show, we're getting ideas on how we can refresh. And all of our TAMP fan members here in this audience today look so refreshed. Put me in the mood here. So now that our closet is organized, it is time to figure out what we're going to be wearing. And more importantly, what we need to go shopping for now that we clear that closet out. Yeah. Cassandra Saiti got her start as part of a team building Soul Cycle and Equinox hot retail brands. Now, as the founder of Next Level Wardrobe, Cassandra calls herself a closet whisperer and uses a three-step method, a method she's sharing with us today. Take a look, Tam Pam. Hey, Tam Pam, Cassandra here from Next Level Wardrobe, and as you can see, I am in my closet. Lots of core colors, lots of tops and bottoms, and a lot of outfits. So how did I do this? I implemented a three-step styling system that I'm going to teach you all about. anybody coming in with a rack of clothing. <laughs> All right. So let's jump into the uh, season and what you're advising clients to buy if yes. they want to this spring season. Yeah, so I don't know about you, but for spring, I am craving color. Yes. So yes. pops yes. of... A lot of great color yeah. in the day. Yeah. yeah. Lots of color, lots of print. Yeah. So I'm seeing a lot of lilacs out in the market, sort of bays, neons. You can kind of take your pick yeah. with whatever you would like. But the most important thing is that you have your essential pieces in your closet so you can wear outfits with your new pieces. Okay, so I'm going to be very honest with you. You mm -hmm. just told me to buy color and you have on gray and black. Oh, yeah. I'm trying to understand. <laughs> but I know that stylists always do that, but you have on essential pieces. Yeah. A good turtleneck is an essential piece. Yes, exactly. And that's the key key to buying trends and actually wearing them. How many of you have items in your closet with tags on them still and you don't wear? You got to get the essential pieces yeah. in your wardrobe so you can create outfits easily. All right. Well, you went shopping. You're going to show oh, us yes. some of what you look for while out on the streets. Take a yes. look. Spring is right around the corner and it's time to refresh that wardrobe. Come with me. I love the lightweight fabric of the shirt for spring, but look at these pockets. Who uses pockets anyways? This is enough. I love this blouse for spring because it's a lighter color. How many of you wear black all the time? Remember to lighten up your color palette for spring. This dress may be tempting for warm weather, but it's gonna be hard to style once you get home. So it's a no. I have seen so many closets that have tons of jeans in them. For spring, I want you to implement a no jeans rule. That means you were buying pants that are not denim. This is a beautiful pair of chocolate brown pants with a little bit of a wider leg that will look amazing. Okay, Cassandra. So interesting, because when you said no jeans, the audience gasped. Mm -hmm. I heard I saw it. that. Because here's the deal, I haven't really worn jeans in about nine or ten years. You know, I'll, I'll reveal this since we're Tam Fam. The reason why I stopped wearing jeans is my dear uh, friend Prince said that a woman's body is too soft to wear jeans. It makes it hard. So I stopped oh. wearing jeans. I know. And it'll be in the book. So, <laughs> but, so, but you're saying trousers are more versatile and you can do more with them. I like that. All right, so we have some Tam Fam members who sent in pictures of their closet because yep. you're a closet whisperer. You can tell a lot about us from our closet. Oh, yes. Oh, boy. Yes. All right, Velma L's closet. Okay, Velma. Okay, Vilma's got a lot of good stuff here. She can't find any of it. Exactly. So the good news is that Velma has space. She, yeah, has, she has two great separate, space. Yeah, two separate closets, yeah. which is awesome. But she needs to do a very honest closet edit uh -huh. so she can actually see what she has and wear it. So she needs to do an edit? Yeah, and I would recommend Velma needs to get rid of 50%. Wow. Of what is in here. You would tell her off the top, half yes. of her closet has to go. Yep, say goodbye to it. Yep, because again, if you can't see it, you're not going to wear it. And you need to see what you have so you can feel confident. So the rule of if you haven't worn it in two years or two seasons, get rid of it, is that true? 
see it. If you haven't worn it, yeah, in two years. I say a year, actually. What? If you haven't worn it in one year, say bye to it. It's taking space in your closet. Look, you have the whole audience <laughs> talking about this. Yes. And I love it. Okay, three-step <laughs> method for this closet. Okay, so the Next Level Wardrobe Style System is a framework that we use on all of our clients, no matter their body shape or age. Okay. So the three-step system, the first part is to control the color in your closet. You don't want your closet to be too dark and you don't want it to be too colorful. You need the core color, so black, gray, white, and navy as what I'm wearing, so you can create outfits easily. Okay. Okay. Um, the second step are essential pieces, so we talked about that. You have to have those essential pieces that you can wear year round and again, get a lot of outfits out of. So a black bottom, a navy blazer, etc. Okay. Okay. All right. And then the third step is fit. Okay. So fit is one of the top three challenges that I hear about yes. all the time. It's so frustrating, right? And that is because brands don't have any standard sizing. Yeah. Okay. Get a tailor. That's first and foremost, yeah. because an easy take up of the hem or shorten of the yeah. sleeve looks so much better. Right. Okay. And the other thing is you have to try a lot of stuff on. I recommend at least trying on five different brands. Oh, thank you so much. I love the advice. Yes, I love thank it. You. Thank Cassandra you. from Next Level.